after a great night out, enjoying seafood and a few extra glasses of wine, you find yourself suddenly awake at 5am with a horrendous burning pain in your right big toe. The pain is so excruciatingly bad that even just a touch of your bed sheet makes you scream in agony. Yes, that's correct. You've just been struck with another gout attack. Hello and welcome to MedTouch, the best place to find the right medical information. If you've ever experienced a gout attack before, you're probably never going to forget it. This destructive inflammatory joint disease may have woken you up in the middle of the night or sent you straight to your doctor's office the next day. Gout, which is a form of inflammatory arthritis, is caused by a buildup of uric acid, a type of waste produced by your body that forms into microscopic crystals. These crystals can settle into joints and cause a massive inflammatory response. They most commonly settle into the small joints where your toes connect to your foot, but they can also affect larger joints too, such as those in your ankles, knees and elbows. When a gout attack strikes, it can often be unexpected and excruciatingly painful, causing severe sharp pain, redness, swelling and a burning sensation in the affected joint. Luckily, with prompt treatment, gout attacks usually pass within a few days. However, the next attack can occur again at any time, without warning. If ignored or left untreated, these attacks can result in numerous health complications such as permanent joint damage, kidney stones and heart disease. That's why in today's video, we're sharing five tips you can use to keep gout away and prevent these painful attacks from coming back. Tip number one, change your diet. In order to avoid an unwanted gout attack, it's important to keep your blood uric acid levels as low as possible. One of the best ways to achieve this is by changing your diet. Why? Well, your body produces uric acid when it breaks down a chemical known as purine. Purine occurs naturally in your body, but it's also found in many types of foods such as red meats, liver, fatty poultry, seafood, high fat dairy products, fructose from fruits and honey, and artificial sweeteners found in candy. By avoiding these foods in your diet, you can help to decrease uric acid levels in your blood, lower the risk of recurring gout attacks, and help to slow the progression of joint damage. So what should you eat instead? Well, it's best to focus on foods that won't raise your uric acid levels, such as low-fat dairy options, lean meats and poultries, plant-based proteins such as tofu and lentils, green leafy vegetables and whole grains. It's also important to get plenty of vitamin C in your diet. Vitamin C can help to prevent gout attacks by decreasing uric acid levels in your body. Fruits are naturally high in vitamin C, so try to opt for lower fructose options such as berries, grapefruit, oranges and pineapples. Tip number two, drink plenty of water and avoid sugary drinks. Once you've had one gout attack, you really don't want another. So, in order to keep gout away, it's important to stay clear of the things that set off your symptoms. High fructose corn syrup, which is commonly found in sodas, fruit juices and sugary drinks, is a well-known culprit for gout flare-ups. This is because sweeteners such as fructose are high in purine, which when consumed, increases the amount of uric acid in your body. So, when it comes to beverages, your best option is to stick with plain water. In fact, water can help to treat and prevent gout by diluting and flushing away uric acid and uric crystals from your body. Aim to drink, at the very least, 2 litres or 8 tall glasses of water each day. Tip number 3. Stop drinking alcohol. When it comes to preventing painful gout attacks, Alcohol is something you'll want to stay well away from. Alcohol consumption, especially beer and hard liquors, increases the likelihood of gout attacks by inhibiting your body's ability to excrete uric acid. Many beverages such as wine and beer are also high in purines, which as you know, your body converts into uric acid. Just one or two glasses of beer, wine or hard liquor can significantly increase your risk. So, if you're someone who enjoys a drink on a regular basis, it's a good idea to cut back. Or better yet, cut alcohol out of your diet for good. 
Tip number four, exercise regularly, but avoid joint injuries. Regular exercise has many, many benefits for your body. It can improve your joint health, help you achieve a healthy body weight and lower your risk of gout by decreasing uric acid levels in your body. However, because gout can superimpose on injured and inflamed joints, when you first start exercising, it's important to start slowly and ease into it with low impact activities such as swimming, walking, stationary cycling, or using an elliptical machine. These activities help to keep your body moving without putting extra stress or pressure on weight-bearing joints. Just remember not to push yourself too hard and if any pain or swelling occurs, stop exercising. Apply an ice pack, elevate your affected joint and seek medical advice if your symptoms don't improve. Tip number five, if necessary, take medication. If you continue to experience frequent painful gout attacks, or if lifestyle and dietary changes aren't enough to reach an ideal level of uric acid in your bloodstream, your doctor may recommend that you take daily prescription medication. Medications help to reduce pain and swelling in your joints during an attack, as well as reducing the amount of uric acid produced by your body. There are different types of medications that work in different ways, so speak to your doctor to determine the best option for your individual needs. So, there you have it, five tips to prevent painful gout attacks. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like this video, subscribe, leave us a comment and turn on that notification bell so we can stay in touch.